This is the Nescafe Smart Coffee Maker. But is it worth it? Let's find out. So before we begin with this review of the Nescafe Smart Coffee Maker, I think we should take a look at what we get inside the box if we buy this coffee machine. So here's the standard Amazon packaging, which we are very used to see. Oh, by the way, at any point in this video, if you think that this product is worth checking out, just head to the links down below in the description and check it out from there. But anyways, let's just don't waste any time and open this up. That was quick. And now as we are in the process of unboxing this, let me also quickly remove this plastic sheet. Now it's better. So this is the retail packaging of the Nescafe e Smart Coffee Maker. On the front of the box it says My Nescafe Connected Mug and down that here it says Compact Coffee Maker, Variety of Coffee and much more blah blah. But what is interesting here is that it says powered by Bluetooth which means you can connect it to your phone. We'll take a look at that later but for now behind all this there is an image of the coffee maker itself. Moving forward to the left of the box we can see the generic name that is Coffee Maker and below that it says contents of the box that is one Nescafe tumbler, one docking station and one dozer spoon. Now moving to the back of the box we can also see how you can use this detachable mug and take it anywhere you go with you. That is you can make the coffee at your home or your office and take this tumbler with you wherever you go. Now below that it lists some of the features of this smart coffee machine. Heating and frosting, hot or ambient, double wall insulation, silent preparation and Bluetooth enabled. Now that's what all it says on the back of the box, nothing else on the other side. Okay, so let's unbox the Nescafe e Smart Coffee Maker. Wait a second guys, let me grab my knife. Now it's good, pop this thing open. So the first and most important thing we see in the box is the instructions, but I guess we don't need this. So here is the My Nescafe Connected Mug. It's very solid and heavy. Let's keep this aside for a moment and let's see what else we get in the box. So here is the dozer spoon. One side of the spoon is 2 grams and the other side is 3 gram capacity. Below this there is another box which contains the user manual and the main docking station. And as of now there is a promotion going on on Amazon. So if you order from the links down below in the description, you will get a free 200 gram Nescafe coffee jar, free with the eSmart coffee maker. But anyways those were all the contents of the box. Now let's begin with the review of the Nescafe Smart Coffee Maker and see if it's actually worth it. So first of all let's talk about the design of the Nescafe e coffee machine. For the design I have to say the Nescafe e Smart Coffee Maker is designed very nicely. This machine looks very modern and it fits in almost every space either in your kitchen, dining, living or even at your office desk. Nescafe e consists of two parts, one is the mug and the other is the docking station. Here mug serves as the main preparation housing just like any traditional coffee machine where you put all the ingredients in and the docking station is where you put the mug and it will brew the coffee inside it. Normally what you would do is you need to put everything inside the coffee machine and it will brew into your mug but what Nescafe has done here is it brews coffee straight into your mug and when you are done you can take the mug with you wherever you go. Not ignoring the fact that most of the traditional coffee machines are bulky as hell but this machine right here is pretty compact. I mean literally you can take this machine anywhere in your backpack. Although the smart mug is a little heavy weighing around 520 grams and the docking station is 420 grams but the foam factor right here is so small that you won't have any problem taking it anywhere. Now using this coffee machine is a breeze. This machine is a smart coffee machine so to use this you need to connect it to your phone via Bluetooth and you need to download the Nescafe e app on your Android or iOS device. Then turn on the Nescafe e by plugging it in into the 220 volt power supply. The power supply may vary according to your country. So now you turn on the Bluetooth of your device and open the Nescafe Cafe e app. Here you can log into your existing account or create a new one. Now after you have logged into your account you need to pair the Nescafe e Smart Coffee Maker. Tap here to pair your device and after you have done that you will land at the home page of the app. Here you can see how much coffee have you drank today and below that there is an option to quickly brew your coffee. Now if you want to see more brewing option you can head over to the next app. So here's something that will blow your mind. This smart coffee machine can make more than 15 types of coffee. Yes. 15 types of coffee and also you can input your own recipe so the possibility right here is unlimited and this machine is also capable of making hot and cold coffee and that's pretty much it for the app there are other tabs like connection and profile but they are not very important to us so the only downside this coffee machine have is the capacity this machine can only brew coffee of 210 ml in one go but as this machine is very quick it can brew coffee in 60 to 90 seconds so if you want to brew more than one cup then you can do it by doing it multiple times and it will only take you a couple of few minutes 
minutes. Now making coffee on this machine is very easy and quick process. You just need to put all the ingredients inside the mug and use the app to brew the coffee. It will not take more than 60 to 90 seconds to brew your coffee and you can enjoy your coffee straight from the smart mug or pour it into one of your favorite mugs. But here comes the tedious part which is cleaning. <laughs> I have to say that cleaning this machine is a bit of a tedious task if you have to do all this by yourself but if you have a maid who can clean this for you then this is something you should not worry about. So to clean this device you need to remove the lid first and clean the inside of the mug with a very mild detergent and a sponge. Do not use any hard detergent to clean this mug as this will damage the internal coating of this mug. Now to clean the lid what Manuel says is that you need to disassemble the lid and clean them individually but what I do is just clean the lid all together. Now you also need to clean this little spinning thing in the mug which rotates and brew your coffee. So those were all the design and how to things but now let's move to the build quality and durability of the Nescafe Smart Coffee Maker. So the Nescafe e-mug is built very solid. I mean it's built like a tank. You can literally take this thing and blow someone's head with this but don't do it, you will get into trouble. Although the Nescafe e-mug is built like a tank, but what I suggest to do also buy another ordinary mug. And what you can do is brew the coffee inside it and pour it into your own mug. So you won't have to worry about dropping and falling it because if this thing dropped, that won't be inexpensive to recover. But anyways, both of the mug and the docking station are built very solid and it will last you ages. Now everything is great about this machine, but you should be thinking that should I buy it or not? So to answer your question, I have to ask a few more questions to you guys, which will determine should you buy this or not. Number one, this is the obvious one. Do you love coffee or not? Next one, how many times do you drink coffee in a day? If it's more than two, then it's good. Number three, are you a busy guy or girl who want to make coffee like that? Number four, this is the last question. Do you want to make cafe like coffee every day at home? If all the answers to this question are yes please, then this coffee machine is for you guys. At the convenience of home and you can brew coffee anytime on demand in 60 to 90 seconds with more than 15 types of coffee. And you can also input your own coffee recipes like this much water, this much coffee and this much milk. And not to mention both hot and cold coffee. And all this stuff is just in one machine. I know I'm literally sounding like a salesman but Trust me guys, this coffee machine is worth it. And when you're comparing this coffee machine price to the other coffee machines, you know what I'm talking about. So if you guys are interested in checking this out, check out the links down below in the description. And that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed this and if you did, just click the like button below and subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. You should do it. And share this video in your coffee religion and I'll see you guys in the next one.